Welcome to Stock Invest YouTube channel and this stock report for PayPal Holdings. The report was first published on our website February 3, 2022, but this is a more detailed version which also includes some fundamental data you need to know. In this 7 to 10 minute long video we give you the information you need to know about PayPal Holdings for the upcoming trading day on Friday 4th, like support and resistance levels, signals, chart analysis, price to earnings ratios, and possible trading levels. Make sure you watch the entire report so you don't miss out on some key information needed for your trading. Please remember to subscribe so we can continue to grow and give you these free videos. Make sure to hit like and notification bell so you will be first to know when we post a new video. Now just sit back, relax, listen and watch the screen as we will show you some interesting data as we move along with the report. In this section you will get some information about the current PayPal holdings performance to better understand the where the stock is right now. In our systems, the PayPal holdings stock currently holds a minus 8.656 score, and our system has ranked PayPal Holdings sell candidate since February 3, 2022. Over the next few days, we will see how this evaluation performs. In our daily updates for PayPal Holdings our last headline reads, PayPal Holdings stock price took a fall of minus 6.24% on Thursday. The PayPal Holdings stock price fell by minus 6.24% on the last day, Thursday, February 3, 2022, from $132.57 to $124.30, and has now fallen three days in a row. During the day the stock fluctuated 6.14% from a day low at $123.85 to a day high of $131.45. The price has fallen in six of the last ten days and is down by minus 28.27% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock, which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 84 million shares and in total, 51 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $6.40 billion. In the last 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $310.16 and the lowest price was $123.85. Right now the price is 59.92%, or $185.86, below 52-week high at $310.16, which also is all-time high for the stock. The PayPal Holding Stock Trends, Predictions and Analyst Ratings Soon we will give you the analyst ratings for the stock, but first the trends. The stock has broken the wide and falling short-term trend down. Firstly a stronger fall rate is indicated, but false breaks and sell-off may occur. However, a further fall is realistic and any reactions back to the breaking point, $152.15, are considered to be a second chance to get out. According to the fan theory $130.11 will represent the new bottom line of the next trend, but it is far too early to say this for certain. The current three-month trend indicates a possible minus 22.26% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 4.04% and 9.75%. The 12-month trend it indicates a minus 25.38% change over the next 12 months with a possible return between minus 12.33% and 57.46%. This equals a price between $108.98 and $195.73 after a year. Analyst Ratings and Price Targets On Thursday, February 3, 2022 Barclays set target to $250 to $200. On Thursday, February 3, 2022 Sanford C. Bernstein set target to $180 to $140. On Thursday, February 3, 2022 Needham & Company LLC set target to $275 to $166. On Thursday, February 3, 2022 DZ Bank set target to $140. On Wednesday, February 2, 2022 Wolf Research set target to $230 to $160. From analysts PayPal holding stock received a general strong buy rating. The analysts give P.E. ratio a strong buy and price to book a strong buy rating. For the return on investment the analysts give the PayPal Holdings stock a neutral rating. In this section, we will give you some information about signals found for PayPal Holdings. 
We will start with the general picture before we move on some of the most famous indicators and signals that will give you a deeper and better understanding of the trading possibilities in the stock. There are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. The PayPal holding stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $154.75 and $178.18. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, February 1, 2022, and so far it has fallen minus 29.29%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Furthermore, there is currently a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence holds a sell signal. Pivots gave a sell signal three days ago. Bollinger gave a buy signal nine days ago. The short-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a sell signal three days ago. The long-term moving average for the three-month chart gave a buy signal 18 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages in the three-month chart gave a buy signal 17 days. If we look at the 12-month chart we see, Short moving average gave a sell signal 3 days ago. The long term moving average gave a sell signal 92 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages gave a buy signal 91 days. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, risk and stop loss for PayPal holdings. There is no support from accumulated volume below today's level and given the right condition the stock may perform very badly in the next couple of days. This stock may move much during the day, volatility, and with a large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $7.60 between high and low, or 6.14%. For the last week, the stock has had a daily average volatility of 5.55%. The stock has a beta of 1.51. This tells us that PayPal holdings is 0.51 times more volatile than the market. Let us have a look at some fundamental data you should be aware of before we tell you some possible good trading levels for PayPal holdings. The price to earnings ratio, P-E ratio, is the ratio for valuing a company that measures its current share price relative to its per share earnings. PayPal Holdings currently has a price-earning ratio of 31.56. This is a relatively normal price-to-earnings ratio and often seen in business with long track record or predictable revenues. Here are some possible good day trading levels. On an upturn, PayPal Holdings meets first resistance at $132.57. If you do not hold PayPal Holdings shares you should wait for this level to be broken before placing your bet. If you already have the stock this is the level you may want to swing trade. The stock does not have any support from accumulate volume below and may therefore fall very hard and fast given the right conditions. Caution is warned and you should not place any bet unless you're a skilled trader and know how to play these cases. Other levels you should watch based on the famous Fibonacci model are Buy at $123.63 $121.84, $118.93. Sell at $129.44, $131.23, The average ratings combined from several analyst sources for PayPal Holdings is strong buy. Here are some of the latest insider trades. On January 3, 2022 Yuri Frank D. made an inside buy of 513 of common stock. On January 3, 2022 Sarnoff and made an inside buy of 513 of common stock. On January 3, 2022 Cristodoro Jonathan made an inside buy of 555 of common stock. 
On January 3, 2022 Dorman David W. made an inside buy of 590 of common stock. On January 3, 2022 Donahoe John J. made an inside buy of 860 of common stock. Based on the 100 latest insides trades, we have calculated the insider power to be negative at a ratio of minus 53.316. In total, the insiders bought 38,380 and sold 138,472 shares in the last 100 trades. We hold a negative evaluation for this stock, no stop loss set. Is PayPal holding stock a buy? PayPal Holdings holds several negative signals and is within a wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For the trading on Friday 4th we expect PayPal Holdings to open up $2.23 and start trading at $126.53. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. That's the end of this video, thanks for watching. Leave a comment if you have any questions and don't forget to subscribe to the channel.